Hey guys, so I'm here today. I'm going to be doing a mini haul of Lush and Ulta. There's about four products from Ulta and about four or five from Lush. So it'll be pretty small, but I'm super excited to show you what I got. I know my eyebrows don't look that good because I did them really quick because it's the end of the night and I just put on makeup to film a video. So just don't mind those and let's get started. So first, the thing that I'm super excited about is this Tarte Resilience Plus sunless tanner. I've never tried a sunless tanner so I thought this would be good to try out since I got it from Ulta so I can return it if it looks horrible but I've seen a few reviews and I want to try it out. I'm going to definitely read the directions because I have no idea how to use this stuff. It comes with a mitt which I thought would help and it comes in a nice little bag that I can like wash if stuff gets dirty in here. So let me know if you want to see me trying this out for the first time in a video or something and I can Caption it like, never try to sunless tanner and stuff like that. So that'll be fun. The next thing I got from Ulta is the Infallible Paints Metallics. I got the silver color because I'm kind of getting more into some cooler tone eyeshadows. I was going to buy a full palette with a silver shade in it. But I was like, why would I even do that? Because I just really, really am kind of intrigued into these gray tones right now. So I was like, I'll just get this one because it'll be cheaper than buying a full palette. And I'm excited to do this and put it in an eye look. I also got this from Ulta. It's the Naked Skin Urban Decay Weightless Complete Coverage Concealer. I've tried this out before and I really do like it. It was on sale for like 14 bucks, so I was like, I'll scoop that up. I got it in Medium Light Neutral. Super excited to try this out. And the one that I tried out was like a sample size, so I'm excited to actually have a full size of this. I really like this because it was nice and light coverage and it still covered everything I needed and it didn't look too cakey under my eyes. The next thing I got is the Anastasia Blush Kit in Radiant. It's like the lighter shade and I'm super excited to use this. I haven't used it at all yet. We can swatch some of the shades. As I can see, all of them have shimmer slash glitter in it except like this one. But I'm pretty sure it'll start spreading so i bet it'll all start to have shimmers in it which i don't really care about honestly but here's the shades they look super pretty on my skin and you can see that second one is this top one and it has more of the like gold shimmers in it which honestly like i said i don't really care about that much i'm super excited to have some more peachy blushes and stuff like that they felt very smooth and soft i really love anastasia and what they do so Let's see how these work. I'm super excited for these two down here. So I'll let you know how those work out. The last thing I have from Ulta is the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder. I have about two of these and I do really love them. This is a really light shade. When I bought it online, I didn't think it'd be this light, but I'll still use it because I love highlighters. And I really do overall like this formula. It's so pigmented and it's so cheap. It's like five bucks. There's two that I have. It's the something blossom, I think, and crown of my canopy. Those are super nice. Recommend those over this. Unless you're super fair, I would definitely recommend this one because this looks super pretty. Okay, so now let's go on to Lush. I got a few things here that I've never had before, so I'm super excited. I heard that their Christmas collection came out, so I was like, I definitely need to go check out what they have. I have a few bath bombs left from Halloween so I didn't pick up any bath bombs I just picked out some like bath melts and stuff like that so let's get started I picked out this Christmas tree bath oil thingy I've never had these and it literally like melts in your hand it's supposed to stand up like this it's literally melting in my hand like chocolate and I'm gonna use half of it and share the other half with my mom I'm gonna put it down because it's literally melting into my hand. I think it's a bath oil. I have to check more on Lush's website, but I thought it'd be really nice to use because you get two parts, and I don't think it was that expensive. And I've never used one of these products, so I thought it'd be fun to use instead of just getting the normal bath bombs. The next thing I got was this little teddy bear bath. I think this might be a bath bomb, or it's a bubble bar. I'm not really for sure. Sorry about that. But I just picked out what I thought was super cute. And I love him. He's so cute. And I'll probably cut him in half too. But super excited about this. And these all smell so good. When I go in there, it just intrigues me to buy stuff so it smells really good in my bathroom and stuff like that. I'm pretty sure this... Oh gosh. I'm pretty sure this is a bubble bar. I kind of got it last week so I don't really remember exactly what these are. But I thought this was so cute. It's an angel. 
and I love how it's sparkly in the back. So I think this is really nice because I can cut it up in a few pieces and I love the smell and I just love how it's an angel. It's super cute and I'm super excited to try this out. The next thing I got is this little unicorn horn. I was a unicorn for Halloween so I thought this was super cute and I love this. I think this is a bubble bar too but I'm not exactly for sure. But I really was excited to try this because it's pink and I love pink. thought this was super cute. I don't think this is in the holiday collection. I think this is just in their permanent line. But I wanted to pick this up because I didn't pick it up last time. The last thing I have is this little guy. This is like a bubble rune. And the middle has like oil in it. That's why it's like looks like frosting. And I think the outside's like a bubble bar thing. So I thought this was super cute. And I think his nose fell off. But I don't know if they have a nose. But I thought this was super cute because it's a snowman and it's just super iconic for the winter and I'm super excited to try him out and I've never tried a bubble room so I thought this would be fun. The only downside about these are they're white so I'm not really going to see them in the bath which is kind of sad but since I have some colorful bath bombs I'll just mix them in with that so it'll be colorful. I'll definitely update you guys somehow if you guys comment below. On anything I'll update how I liked everything but I don't think I'll make a full video like I did for the $300 haul but just comment on anything on my social medias or anything and I'll let you know how I like them all those were kind of like melting in my hands so guys that's all I have for my little mini haul I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys next time bye guys